what these are? Yellow sheets. Yellow sheets. A backlog to choke a horse. And where is Detective Third Grade Robert Crocker? Anywhere lately? I've been at her apartment. Oh, really? I thought you moved in. Well, she needs encouragement, Lieutenant. She needs somebody to do more than just uh, dust the furniture and check her pulse. Now, speaking of dusting the furniture, are you aware she lives in an $800 a month apartment? Oh, where'd she get the bread? She got a John? What's the story? What's he trying to say? Ask him. I don't know what I'm trying to say. And you want to know why? Because there's a hot shot detective who's failing to function. Hey, uh, Lieutenant, you know, um, going through the motions of being a cop, I can't investigate a girl I almost killed, not with this, not with this other stuff on my mind. If that other stuff on your mind was some old degenerate wino instead of a beautiful, mysterious chick, you'd know what to do. I'm doing the best I can from going through my head. You push me and I'll quit. If you don't shape up, I'll request it. Crocker! I mean, he should have a leave of absence. I need him, Frank. What for? He hasn't been here since he shot that girl. And when he is here, he's not all here. Tell me about it. You know, I met that girl. She doesn't know what hit her. It didn't happen. The Crocker as well as the girl. Lieutenant, a funny thing happened to me trying to locate a suspect on that Anderson case. I show a bunch of pictures to the bartender, and one of them's a steady customer, the late Jamie Webb. Uh, Bernadette, this is Captain McNeil, Lieutenant Kojak. This is Ms. Bernadette Fopler. Bernadette won first prize in a bartending contest in Atlantic City in 73. 72. They were suckers for fruit juice that year. I called my drink Indian Summer. This fella gave me the idea. Well, don't you get it? He helped her think up this drink. Bill, Buzzy, Buffy. Well, it was a very close friend of the, the deceased, Jamie Webb. He said he came from Cleveland. Cleveland. Indians. Get it? Indian summer. Could you describe them? Describe? In the booze business, it's the color of the money, not the face. Okay, you call Cleveland, get the best description you get from our charming young lady here, and then uh, see if you can tie it in with James Webb. And thank you very much for your cooperation. Thank you. Yes. Gee, Bernadette, I'm sorry. I could have sworn it was 73. It's all right. Hey, you're getting back to Bobby. I gather you don't like the girl. Frank, that's not nice. Frank? Well, you implied she was being kept by a John. No, no, no. Where are the tea bags? I don't know where the tea bags are. And uh, no, you inferred she was being kept by a John. Come on, you know Bobby Crocker. He still goes to these church functions in order to find dates. This chick has got him wiped out, whoever she is and whatever she is. Theo, you're on the spot too, and so am I. Everybody's watching how we handle this, and I'm talking about the shooting. I want Crocker off the hook on this shooting, of course, but I also want the answers. Detective Crocker, six-year veteran, etc., etc., and this Miss Ames, a very successful fashion model when she came here from Cleveland three years ago.